Hey, good morning everyone. This is Harold. Uh, today is the 13th of May and today I'm going to do the big day, seeing as much as many bird species as possible. And it's, uh, it's already almost 5.30 in the morning and I'm on my way to, my, uh, to meet my, uh, my teammate, Peter. And um, yeah, last year we saw a total of 107 species. And uh, yeah, let's see if we can, can break our record of last year and see uh, more than 107 species. So here we are, uh, it's around 9 o'clock already and we already found 81 species, so that's uh, it's quite an achievement. So the highlights so far are uh, Ictorine warbler, uh, we had marsh warbler and we had a windjet and a peregrine falcon and uh, yeah we're going to look for more species. So it's uh, already 12.30 right now and uh, so we're already uh, halfway our big day and we are close at uh, 100 species, uh, 98 to be, uh, to be exact. So two more species and we, uh, you know, we are at 100 species. However, we are having trouble finding some, some common species like the, uh, the nuthatch. We haven't found a, a nuthatch so far and no long-tailed tit. Uh, Eurasian spoonbill. We haven't uh, we haven't found that one. However, we uh, we found one uh, common quail, and um, what else? Eurasian hobby. We saw a Eurasian hobby, and um, let me think. What else? <laughs> um, half inch, half inch, and we're now looking for a um, tawny owl, but no, we can't find it, and. Uh, um, so uh, I had to stop filming because my um, my fellow team member Peter he's, he he called me and he saw one uh, northern goshawk. So uh, we are at 99 species. Uh, so one more species and uh, we are at a magic number of 100. So um, yeah, we're going to look. We're going to try find the, the nuthatch and the long-tailed tit and the spoonbill and also the kingfisher. We have to find it. So. Uh, and we still have a few a few hours left to complete our big day. So uh, let's see what we can find anymore. Hey everyone, it's uh, almost six o'clock, so that means that our big day is, uh, is over. We found 108 species and I'm, <laughs> I'm exhausted. We, uh, we traveled so, so many kilometers on this day by bike. And uh, yeah, we, in the end we found our nut hatch and um, uh, our spoonbill, but we don't have a long tail tit. Uh, and we also found a northern shoveler and um, I think that's, uh, that's it. I think uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's quite a good list. We have one species more than, uh, than last year, but I think we could have some more species. But uh, yeah, <laughs> sometimes, the, the, uh, some, sometimes some species don't, uh, don't show themselves and uh, it's, it, it, that's it what it is. And uh, so please find the complete list below my video. 
and uh, thank you for watching and uh, goodbye i'm going to eat and then i'm going to go home and to sleep so that's it goodbye hey hello everyone um this is just a final remark on the on the big day we did uh i i, I wasn't able to do some proper filming anymore at the, at the end of the day so uh that's why the end was <laughs> you know uh, uh i didn't explain much about the, about the day but uh like i've said we had a uh, um, a total of 108 species one more than uh, than last year so we 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 did broke our uh, our own record however uh, um there was another team who uh, who saw a total of 115 species so uh, uh, uh unfortunately we were not the winning team we were with uh, uh all together with seven teams seven different teams and uh you know the the win the winning team had a total of 115 species and uh um Usually the big day, uh, at least in, in, in my city, uh, uh, is uh, you know they, they, they do that at the beginning in the beginning of May, the early the early days around six or seven, the sixth or seventh of May. Uh, however, this year we decided to do it a little bit later in uh, in May, uh, the second week, as you have the you have a, uh, more chance on. Uh, more species that come here to breed in uh, in, in in our country. However, uh, at the end of the big day last Saturday, we uh, you know we came all together. That we had a you know we had a we just checked all the birds. Uh, everyone saw, and uh, you know some team some teams saw different birds than the other team. Uh, but in total, for all the all the teams together. All teams together saw a total of 128 species, I think. Yeah. So of the 128 species, we saw 108. Uh, however, um, last year the big day was at uh, the seventh on the seventh of May, so a little earlier in in May. And uh, um, last year, all the teams together saw a total of 140 species. So that's 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 a little different, uh, um, you know. That's the difference if you if you do the the big day, the early days of May, or in the you know halfway May, and it has to do with the fact that uh, um, by the in, in the in the early days of May you still have the chance to see some of the wintering bird species that you know bird species that come here to to winter and they're leaving uh, um, around April, the end of April and the early days of May. But if you're already halfway May, then most of the of the wintering species have already gone. However, uh, we we were lucky to saw uh, to saw some uh, to see some um, uh, Eurasian widgeons. Uh, it's 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 a wintering species. You you won't find them in 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 summer. Well, maybe maybe one or two individuals, but but that's it. But uh, yeah, we were lucky to see to see some uh, some widgeons. And, uh, um, and and if you do it, if you if you um, uh, do the big day a little bit later in May, then you have the chance that most of the species are already breeding and they're not showing themselves. Uh, you know, they're they're breeding, uh, hatching, hatching, breeding and hatching their eggs. So um, they're not birds are not really active by them. So in the in, in the early days of May, uh, birds are still active. You know, with courtshiping and, uh, and singing and uh, displaying and uh, but, however, we had a, we had a really fun day. It was a very long day, uh, twelve hours of non-stop um, cycling, um, watching, listening, and uh, it, it it was a very sunny day, but uh, the sun was uh, burning a little bit, and uh, yeah, I was I was super exhausted. I was <laughs> I was super exhausted. So the day after the Sunday. Um, I couldn't do anything. <laughs> I just stayed at home and uh, you know didn't do some bird watching. So um, that's what I wanted to uh, you know to say as a final remark. Now that I'm you know uh, uh, I had a rest and now I'm, I'm uh, you know I'm <laughs> I'm back again and uh, uh, you know uh, I found the energy to to do some filming again. So 
that's what I wanted to, to share with you. So, um, as I've mentioned on the big day, uh, please find the complete bird list in the description of this video. You can find all the 108 species we, we found that on, on that day. And uh, I will also um, uh, add uh, the species we didn't saw. So in total, there will be the, the 128 species, uh, uh, 108 uh, of which we saw and the rest we didn't see. So uh, please find it in the description. If you like my video, uh, please uh, hit the like button. Uh, also consider uh, subscribe yourself to my channel. Um, hit the notification bell so you will be notified every time I upload a new video. And uh, that's it. Uh, maybe next year I will be, uh, I will be uh, in Costa Rica probably with my family. So this will be the probably the the, the, the last big day I did in, in the Netherlands. Maybe next year I will do one in uh, in Costa Rica, but uh, <laughs> we'll see we'll see what happens. So um, thank you for watching and uh, goodbye.